here's the antenna that I used along with some of the tools and hardware needed for the install. Here's a close-up view of the antenna and how I mounted it. I mounted it on the end of a 1x4 board that's approximately 18 inches in length. I used three screws to fasten it to the house. And eventually we'll have to prime and paint the board to match the color of the house. But this video is basically just to show you the install and what the antenna looks like and what the results that I had in installing it. As you can see, we have a lot of trees in our area, but that doesn't seem to affect the clarity in the picture of the channels, and we get approximately 60 channels. So we were very happy with the results, and total cost with cable, hardware, antenna, the amplifier, booster, signal part, was under $100. So if you can do it yourself, you can save a lot of money. And basically, our TV and internet, direct TV and internet bill was about $153. Now, going forward, it'll be $43 for a savings of $110. And basically, after watching all the content, we feel like we were watching a lot of the channels, the local channels with a lot of the TV programs on that we get for free we were paying for before, which didn't really make a lot of sense. And here's a quick shot of basically we just kind of routed it around the house. Just kind of a quick video just to show you basically we just kind of set it up to get the TV working in time we'll make everything more permanent and here's a picture of a splitter we have one coming in from the antenna and then two going out one to the TV in the bedroom and one to the TV in the living room and just notice as well we use RG6 cable RG6 cable from what I've read and did my research on seems to be the best cable with the less, least amount of interference so your TV will come in your picture will come in very clearly and as you can see right now it's the end of September and there's still a lot of leaves on the trees but in the next month or so, a lot of the leaves will fall off. But I'm just, we were really amazed at the picture quality and how many channels we got, even though there is as many trees as there is. But we didn't have a choice because our TV antenna locator told us this was the direction we needed to point our antenna. So 